Pato. Ah, oh, there we go. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Birdside Plays. God of War. Wow. Ragnarok. This looks like a city. Welcome hey. to Neither. Hey. Hey. Who are you? What's up? Oh. I'm gonna eat you. They're uh, running away. They are, and I also don't know why Mel got us keeps turning the volume down. No. 36. That we go. It only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was feeling the notion of being detached from it. Why hold that for us, though? They are scared. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody high? We woo, we woo. We don't have to fight and kill dwarves. Hey, can we talk to you for a There'll be no help to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own. The fuck? <laughs> what is that? Pizza. I guess that's a new thing I'm gonna get at some point. Is that a statue of Odin? They must really love it. Hmm. Hendry, hello. I return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. All right, what have I left behind? Thank you. What is it, dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones would talk. Then they'd have mouths. <laughs> Filthy, disgusting mouths. <laughs> Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Oh, you're long overdue for a replacement. Taking advantage of certain material. Ow. Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something ah, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for uh, finally trying it. What's it gonna be this time? Patience. I find it's best to see these things oh, in action. Ah. Perfect. Ooh. Take aim at that gate there, but before you loose, say, ski off. Ski off. Ski off ah! Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlies in need of a leer. How was I supposed to know they were there? That's kind of sad. I was really hoping to, like, talk and meet with more dwarves. Hmm. Well, first... Another Good. Another poem. <clears throat> the armies assembled, nine warriors strong. Well rested and fed, for the war it would be long. The orb in the air and branches in hand. A swing, a collision, 
the spectators stand. For nine nights and nine days they fight without rest, running then waiting to prove themselves best, until finally, mercifully, the army does rot. One triumphant, one army triumphant, the other struck out. Okay, so that's rap. My bad. Mine. <gasps> A rainbow. I'm sorry. Mm. Fire. Fire bad. Haha! So I knew there had to be one. Okay, I know I knew there had to be some ravens. There's no way you'd bring everything else back except for the ravens. Ah, I'm gonna be on the hunt. Pretty sure I've you know, more than likely there's gonna be some that I've missed, but any outsider is considered a threat. Is that to protect the dwarves? It sounds like it. But knowing Odin, there's sure to be an ulterior motive. Well, that's fair. Too. Odin's occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Is this that you made an example of? To keep the rest in line? Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear fair. keeps them safe and alive. That's fair, actually. The tavern's gotta be around here somewhere. Maybe we can try knocking open doors for directions. Nah, I don't think that'll do us any good. Well, I want to get over there. Hello? Did they leave? Special equipment to use this. Yeah, probably. I mean, this looks important, but. This looks promising, right? It's like a house. If he's here, maybe you should let me do the talking. You? Well,. We don't want to intimidate him. You're tall as a tree and you have a severed head on your head. <clears throat> None taken. Good point, though. I think that's him. Hello? Watch yourselves. Apparently, there are intruders about. Oh, <laughs> that's us, I think. Eh, well, we're planning on killing him. At least let me finish this song. That alarm was just the perfect key. We're just looking for a friend of ours named Derlin. <laughs> well, we both know that's not true. Derlin's got mm -hmm. no friends left. But if that's all you need, head out the back way there. You'll see the safety office just across the road. Just don't go making trouble for the rest of us. Okay. And while you travel through this realm, maybe you could clean up the head's mess. Oh. Later, brother. Interesting. Also, it seems you have a side quest. I wish to hear of this mess. The rig's in the bay. Why don't you ask the condescending skull? Head, I've got skin. But he's right. I made a mistake. I'd have us shut them down. Alright, what's that? Uh, hang on. Oop, oop. Uh, may prove useful. Okay. Interesting. Also, I'm going to go back for a sec, because there was also a secondary path to take. I guess three paths now. A fireball from the chief anti odin propagandist in Durland's Rebellion. Quite a sharp witch she had until she turned to 
by subtle means of resistance. Ah. There's a lot to explore in this city. Give me a minute. I want to see what's over here. Okay, so that's just another way around. Cool. Good to know. What's up here? Okay. This was the other direction I wanted to go. I don't have the thing for that yet. I think we need some special equipment to use it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go fuck yourself. Which means, I, no matter what, I have to come. I'll have to come back to the city. Damn. All right. Well, I guess off we go. Boop. Yeah, it's a spam call. Sorry, I was getting a phone call and it's spam! Sorry, yes. one more thing. Although, these are gifts I'm giving to you, so I shouldn't be sorry and you should be thankful. Anyways, here, please be careful. It's beautiful. Thanks, Sindri. It is beautiful, isn't it? It's also very useful. You'll be able to find anything your heart desires with it. Really? As long Compass. as your heart desires the locations your father and you decide and plot to travel together, then yes. It is a compass. Ah, but a beautiful compass. Now scamper off. Yeah, that's fair. I was wondering when... There we go. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, I already know where I'm going. Oh fuck it. Which is why we still explore. Was being the key word here, little brother. Yeah, I'm just gonna wander through their home and steal their shit. I don't think they'll mind. There we go. I saw a dock back there. You know, while at Sindri's shop, I probably should have started upgrading my shit. Also, I still need to keep an eye out if I see any more ravens. Why is his music getting louder if we're getting further away from him? Oh, hey. Gateway. That would be nice. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. We can try. Ugh, those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The skull is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel. Sure, I mean, that is my plan. Do that first. I particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. Sure. But if you don't want to explore now, 
Looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. I'll explore. So, which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. Rick's built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and, well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. Makes sense. Is that a watchtower? Well, at least I see the bird flying. Little fucker. Yeah, one second. Okay, it's just sending me in a fucking circle. There we go. One of the mining rigs is here. See the smoke above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can shut it down. Okay. Hmm. Where? Ah, there we go. The dwarves didn't like working for Asgard. Couldn't they just quit? Do what? Their newly built forges poisoned the soil of Svartalfheim. Unable to grow their own food, they had to buy it from Asgard. Working, they'd be taking food out of their own mouths. Oh, that's clever. I'm gonna get over there. How? There's gotta be some way to get through there. I guess as I can get up somehow. Whatever. What's that? Oh. Okay, that might come in handy. Guess we'll find out. Thinking, I guess. Going through Surtur's gauntlet. It was fun. It was training. You didn't have fun? Well, anyway. You should look for the other half of the seat. Once it's whole again, you see where it leads. Right, how do I get it? Anything illuminating. A warning. Oh, I got it. I'm an idiot. Make it across. 
Because I did not see that. The first time. Yeah, get back up there, boy. Give me one second. Oh God! They just keep coming. It's a bear trap. Spawning a little wedge is like there's no tomorrow. Well, hurry, will be so. Might as well. I haven't used it in a while. They made their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfheim ore. And it won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Huldra brothers could craft something from it. Hmm. Fair. Could be useful. Oh, stretch. Remember the Man, way down. How many stories have you told about Odin and Thor? And all the bad things they've done. We'll discuss that later, because I've been needing to pee this entire episode and putting it off, so thank you guys so much for watching. Uh next time at Bird's Eye we will explore the other two rigs. I'll see you guys next time.